camping resort in um, Norwich, Connecticut. And that might not be the name of the town. I might have made that up, but in Connecticut. And this is our camp site. Um, I guess the campsite is a pro and a con because it's a beautiful site. You know, it's got lots of trees, so it's nice and shaded, and it's uh, fairly large. Um, the con is that it was advertised as a pull-through site. And as you can see, we pulled through. So there's the road we came in on, and we pulled through. But um, as of right now, there's nobody in the camp site right ahead of us. And if it stays that way, we may be able to get the truck in in front of the camper via this little road um, and, and hook up the camper here and then kind of take it out that way. That's if nobody comes into this site, which is directly ahead of our site. Um, if people do come in here, um, the staff who guided us to our site yesterday told us that we may have to back the camper out. So technically this is not a pull through site if you have to back your camper out. So we're going to have to um, swerve the car, the truck in this way and hook it up and then back it out this way. And I don't know how many of you have backed out a camper before, but this doesn't look easy to me. So we have to go through those two big trees, which is kind of a tight squeeze, back it way up and then um, somehow get it onto the road. Right up here, up those stairs, is a basketball court. And it's been pretty active. People really like to play basketball here. So there's been basketball players almost the whole time, except for, you know, late at night. Okay, down this way. Now, see, this is another campsite directly in front of ours. So if no one comes into this campsite, which is kind of small, right now we have a pretty decent view. I don't know if you can see uh, in the distance there is the lake. And this camps, campground has an, a beautiful, beautiful lake. Um, there's a beachy area to swim, you know, we'll show you all that later. Um, that's the main house next to it where you check in and the store is. And I think there's a bakery or something in there, but we'll take you in there too. And then directly behind that house are um, bathrooms, bathhouse, and the pool, which is a beautiful pool. We were up pretty late last night. There was lots and lots and lots of noise coming from up there. And we read the reviews before we came in, and we read that this place was pretty serious about their 10 o'clock quiet time, but apparently that's not the case because um, there was loud music and laughing and, and all kinds of horseplay going on up there um, into the wee hours. I'm going to say um, after midnight, they were still partying up there. It didn't bother me. You know, it's, it didn't bother us. We were fine, but... You know, if you're the type of person who comes camping for peace and quiet, this may not be the place for you because apparently they're not very strict about their quiet time. It's got beautiful um, features and pools and, you know, all kinds of great stuff to do. There's actually even a, a trailer here where um, you can get a massage or a facial. Um, they do pick up your trash. You don't have to bring your trash anywhere. So you just leave your trash by a tree and they pick it up for you. They deliver to your campsite. So if you want food from the restaurant, yep, there's a restaurant. If you want food from the restaurant, they you can call them and they will bring it to you. And if you need firewood, you can call them and they will bring you firewood. So um, it's got lots of, lots of amenities, lots of features, lots of fun stuff to do. Um, it just may not be the perfect place for people who are looking for peace and quiet because there wasn't a whole lot of that here. Anyway, we'll talk more about it later. So what are we going to do? We're going to go on a little tour. We're going to walk around. We're going to go down to the store, which is right down there, and we'll show you what it looks like.
Oh, it's a magnet. This is a sticker. Yeah. That's a magnet. Nice. Oh, it's in Bozra. I thought it was in Stanley Museum. No. What is that? Oh, it's just, oh, it's a dog bandana. But how do you, you I guess you put it on his collar. collar. Oh, that's, a oh, that's, that's a really good idea. These are adorable. Too bad we don't have any little, little, littles. Five dollars. Yeah, let's get this because okay. he will get a blue one. Because he's a boy. Poses, power cords. Those are light. Yeah. They're not, I don't think they'll last, but. That's cute, huh? Uh huh. Morning, how are you? Good, thanks. It's a little coffee shop. In the, the bake, bake good. Yeah, it would be. Yeah. Gorgeous tent sites right Beautiful. by the lake. If I was a tenter, this is where I'd want to be. So nice. Lots of people here. Lots of kids. It's a beautiful day. Yeah. Snack shop over there? Uh huh. Yeah, that's the restaurant. That's the restaurant. That's the restaurant over there. You can rent boats here too. Oh, can you? You can rent a boat or a kayak. I think it's ten dollars an hour is what I read. Lots of picnic tables around, so you can either get something at the restaurant, or I guess you can bring your own lunch down to the beach. Horseshoe pits. They're having a horseshoe tournament too. The entry is a dollar and a beverage. Winner take all. Morning. Morning. Hot dogs smell delicious. So it's the very first time I ever threw a horseshoe. Alright, my turn. Beautiful stage. So what do you think? I think it's beautiful right here. Right? I think this lake area is the highlight of this whole campground. It's just gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. Definitely. It's definitely a beautiful property. I mean, yeah, they yeah. seem to take generally really good care of it. There's a lot of employees running around. And yeah. 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 Lots of stuff going on. This is nice. Today started off better than yesterday did. Yeah, yesterday was... Yesterday was a little bit rough when we looked at the site and realized that we weren't going to be able to turn around super easily and get out of there, but we'll see how it goes. I mean, if we had known coming in that it was going to be like that, it's one thing, but when they advertise it as a pull-through and it's not, it's annoying. Yeah. Oh, well, that's cool. Oh, uh, a little that's stage. Yeah, it's very nice. The people outside are making no bake doll treats. Very cool. Out here. Oh, nice. One of the activities. Yeah. Very cool. Mini golf. 18 holes. How much is it? I don't know. Mini golf is ten dollars a person. Good 
Just needs a coat of paint. There's one of the rental cabins. Really cute. They're, they're long, so they must be roomy inside. Quesadillas with yellow rice with peas. Delicious. I'm gonna go to bingo. How much are you gonna win at bingo? Thousands. At least four dollars. <laughs> at least, yeah. If not thousands. You're gonna win. Oh, it's millions. <laughs> looking great here at the end of day two <laughs> camping. <laughs> you love the texture of what? That's oh, potato chips. What? Yeah, they have like a really, like a crispy yet foamy texture. So, foamy? What the like, heck does that even mean? Like pool noodle, but crispy. <laughs> Alright, if you say so. <laughs>